Okay, so I had to get on here really quick. Um, I feel like I'm going to do a vlog today. I'm going to add our food in here from yesterday because my husband and I went out to eat. And then my friend and I went out to dinner, so I'll just add that in this vlog. But this was kind of like a last minute thing. I only got ready because I did a TikTok video today. And I was like, you know what? I'm going to go see what I can find Easter-wise. Um, because I always get like these Hello Kitty greeters and my husband and I were at Walmart yesterday and I was so disappointed because the Hello Kitty that was there um, was the Hello Kitty that was there last year for um, Easter and I was like I have that one already and <laughs> this guy is just literally waving to me he probably thinks I'm like talking to myself or something I don't know but anyway um, yeah so the Hello Kitty that was at Walmart was the one they had last year so I said, I haven't stopped at CVS for like ever. Um, so I said, I'm just going to randomly stop there today. And I literally walked in there and there it was. There was only one there. And I feel bad because normally I go there all the time and I didn't go there for Valentine's Day. So now I'm wondering if I missed one for Valentine's Day, but whatever. Um, so now I'm going to check through the videos and see if this is the only one they have for Easter or if there's a different one because my CVS only had this one and yeah so um, I'm going to Zumba actually tonight and there's a CVS kind of close to Zumba so maybe I'll stop down there and see if there's a different one um, I don't know we'll see so anyway I went in there and I was like oh my god here's a different one and I will show you what this one looks like so I'm super excited if you see maybe I'll do in a collection video of my Hello Kitty greeters because I think I told you guys before um, like I have them in my bedroom and if you see like where I've been doing like most of my TikTok videos or my videos lately um, like that pink room that I do most of my videos in that's like my craft room slash makeup room and that is like attached to my bedroom but the way that wall is like it's like kind of like half a wall kind of like through our bedroom and I have all of my Hello Kitty greeters like all up along that wall and they can I'm this might be the last space I have for my Hello Kitties so now I don't know I'm gonna have to like make a shelf down from it now my husband I can't make a shelf I mean I can but I mean it'd be like crooked and everything else I hung this is like a side note I feel like I have I go off like on topics really bad I hung a shelf. I hung a shelf. Um, my husband like builds stuff for a living. That's what he does. Construction. Um, I also help him. Normally, he just makes me paint um, because I'm not really good pounding nails or anything like that. I mean, I can, but not very. I don't have much patience. But anyway, I hung a shelf in the kitchen the other day, well, weeks ago, and he comes in because I've asked him to hang it for a while. And he just gets so busy or he gets sidetracked or whatever. So I just did it myself. I'm just like, oh, it's whatever. And I'm not like too picky. I'm just like, whatever. And like, if you decorate it, I feel like it's fine. Like people don't pay attention to it. Well, he must have. It took him a while to notice it because he's like, he's like, did you hang that shelf over there? And I said, yeah, why? Needless to say, I already have stuff on it. And like, after I kind of decorated it and everything, like I could tell, like, if you like showed your head, it looked fine. But like if you like kind of like looked at it straight on, it was kind of a little bit crooked, but I'm like, whatever. Um, and he's like, like, it's a little bit crooked. And I was like, it's not that bad. Like it was just a little bit crooked. And I was like, you should have did it. Cause I asked you like for three weeks, like, can you do that? So like, it is a little bit crooked. So he's going to have to put the shelf up like a little bit down from it because I'm going to run out of room for Hello Kitties. Um, because I mean it's a collection habit right so anyway like I was at my friend's house a little bit let me show you this Hello Kitty first off topic so here is the new one from CVS and they raised the price thanks a lot this whole everything's like so expensive this year I'm not even gonna say why inflation thanks a lot these were $20 these used to be $20 always $20 now this was $32 this year whatever I still bought it um how cute is this it's pink ear to blue ear and 
It is so cute. It has a little carrot. Um, I'm get, I am going to Walmart again because I didn't get, they had a whole bunch of clearance like I need any kind of anything. They had like clothes and all kinds of just random shit that I just didn't want to look at. Like I wanted to look at but my husband really didn't want to look at. He told me I could but I didn't. And um, they had like peeps and stuff like that. Like the Easter stuff out that I didn't want to like drag them through. Yesterday we were kind of in a hurry that I did want to look at but I didn't want to look make them look at so I am going back to Walmart and I'm going to TJ Maxx so I will kind of show you guys the Easter stuff that'll probably be a separate video I will upload that um, separately but maybe I'll add some stuff in this vlog um, but I'll upload uh, I should have recorded everything they had in there too too late but anyway um, this is the one they have for this year a little tail back there kind of cute I love them, her, whatever, um, and I'm really upset that Walmart doesn't have a new one, and I'm really upset that I didn't check to make sure about Valentine's Day. I wasn't even thinking about Valentine's Day, but anyway, I am going to TJ Maxx, and then I'm going to go to Walmart, and I think that's it because I want to go home. I am going to, I have my, um, my ladder in my living room, which my cats love. And I leave my ladder, I'm not gonna lie. I leave my ladder in my house pretty much a lot. Uh, my cats love it. I call it the stairway to heaven because like all of my cats are always on that ladder and I don't have the heart to take it out of my house. Um, which is kind of ridiculous because if you've ever seen my pictures on Facebook, I post them all the time. I decorate their stairs, they have them in the corner. Um, because they have like this little cat corner that goes up and then they have like the shelf or whatever. I don't know what you ever want to call it. It's like the little corner. So they have like these spiral steps that they're, it's their steps. So you would think because they love the ladder so much and the ladder takes up so much room. So I'm like, oh my God, my husband found these steps. I don't know what they were for. I don't know if it's for plants originally or... If they were, I don't know what they're for originally, but they're like spiral steps. And I'm like, oh my God, that's perfect. Like they're cat steps. They're meant for us. So I'm like, the cats are going to love it. They love ladders. They love steps. They're going to absolutely love it. You think them cats will go in them damn steps? They do. Not really. They'll just like jump on it to get onto the like, um, windowsill. Not like that ladder. They love that ladder. So I don't know what I'm going to do. Um, I'm in the process. This video is all over the place. I'm sorry, you guys. Like, I have so much to tell you guys. They've just been, like, all over the place. But I'm in the process right now. I took their cat tree out. It's, like, on my deck right now. And I'm putting all of their cat stuff onto my wall. <laughs> Sounds crazy. But um, I did do a video of their bridge. Only one cat goes on that damn bridge. But I have faith on some of them will go on the bridge maybe not maybe only one of them will go on there that's fine um but i have like some shelving and stuff like that that they, i know they will go on and some other things but their whole cat stuff is going on my wall just to get up off the floor and it's going to go on the wall so i'm going to do a video on that I'm going to go shopping today. That's in the process. That's not going to be today, but it's slowly in the process. I will record that when that's done. Been slowly recording it as I get it done, but whatever. The ladder's in my room or in my living room. That's what I was talking about. I'm all over the place, but I am going to decorate um, for St. Patrick's Day. That's why the ladder is in there. Um, so I'm going to do a video of decorating Skelly because Skelly is still in my living room if you guys don't follow my daily videos um i do still have skelly in my living room so i'm going to decorate him for saint patrick's day um and then i still do have my two skellies down and my driveway and i live in pennsylvania and it was so freaking windy so windy um and my skellies have been up since october since halloween obviously and they have been amazing. Like my husband did so good at putting them up. Um, and we weren't originally planning on keeping them up forever. Like we were planning on taking them down. And then I was like, everything happened. My pap got sick. Um, my mom got sick and then his dad got sick and I was like, well, we'll just leave them up. 
and then we'll decorate them. And my husband, poor, my husband's like such a supporter, especially since we're so opposites, but he's like, you know what? Yeah, that's a great idea, hon. You know? So he's like, yeah, we'll leave them up. That's a good idea. <laughs> and, um, we left them up and he, he literally put them up so good that they stayed up through winter, through a lot of wind and everything else. So they stayed up amazing until a couple days ago. And it was so, so windy. Um, we normally don't hear anything in our house. He built our house so good. It's like literally soundproof. And it was just so freaking windy. Like you would think a tornado went through. Um, and we had one skelly down. Uh, and if it was, if it wasn't so warm, like a couple days prior to that, the base of the skeleton was literally under ice, like a couple inches. It was probably under five inches of ice because it was so icy. Um, and our driveway, uh, it's about half mile long, but our driveway just runs down like all the water. So the skellies just hit with all the water and the base of them were just like completely solid full ice. So I'm like, crap. Um, they still had their Santa hats on, but I did decorate them for Valentine's Day, but I couldn't get their hats off because they were frozen like to their heads. Um, so they were kind of half decorated for Christmas still, kind of half decorated for Valentine's Day. I'm like, whatever. Um, and then like it all defrosted at one time and then it like windy one fell over the one still stood up. So I was like still impressed. Um, so one fell down his arms off, but it, thankfully they didn't break or anything. So we got them back up. And they're still decorated for Valentine's Day. So I got to get the ladder down there. It's still freezing here. Um, but I still got to get down there. I got to get them redecorated and get back into different holidays and get them redecorated. Because my neighbor's going to be like, what is this person doing? We're celebrating all these holidays. And I have, I have Halloween down there. I have Christmas down there and Valentine's Day. And I'm going to get ready for St. Patrick's Day. They're going to really think I'm a hot mess. So I can't decorate completely for every single holiday. So um, I got to get down there and get them redecorated too. So that's what's going on in my world. Just wanted to get on here and show you this Hello Kitty. Let's go to TJ Maxx, see what we can find there. And then we're going to head over to Walmart. So um just wanted to show you guys that. Um, if you guys aren't following me on TikTok, I literally have been doing so good at posting videos on there. I've been trying to go live on there, honestly, a couple times a week, um, which has been super fun. And I think I'm going to start going live on Instagram, just um, like days that I get like ready, like just get ready with me videos. I think I'm going to start doing those on Instagram. So make sure you're following me like on all of my links. They're in the information box. And I'm going to start keeping up with my blogs and stuff like that. Um, just especially since I have a lot more um, social time, I guess. I don't know. I've just been keeping up with everything like that. So um, I miss you guys. And yeah, let's go over to TJ Maxx and see what we can find. I'm in my husband's truck too today. So I'm literally in this big truck and this woman's like backing out. And she's looking at me like I'm going the wrong way. Like there's like literally an arrow. Hold on. See that arrow? She was going the opposite way. I was going the right way. So, and I'm in a truck. Like I cannot back like the whole way back the aisle because you're going the wrong way. Sorry. And she's looking at me wrong arrow. Anyway, I'm going to TJ Maxx and I always forget these. I have like $30, $40 in these. And I literally always forget them. And I, or I throw them away or something like that. Well, not today. I am literally taking them in with me because I spend enough money in here to not throw them away. So going in here, where am I at? Where's TJ Maxx at? No, that's all these. There's TJ Maxx. We're going in here and then we're going to go to Walmart. Let's go. I should not have went into Walmart. I came out with too many peep stuff. Oh my gosh. And my Walmart wasn't even fully stocked of their Easter stuff yet. So I'm going to probably end up going back. I hope not, but I probably will. I know I'm in Walmart all the time, so I will probably end up going back. I did record what they had out. I will post a video of it. Um, so go check out my channel and I will upload a video of just their Easter stuff that they did have out. I'll upload a video 
um, updated when they get more stuff out. Um, but they did have a lot of stuff out. So, um, go check that out. I posted, uh, recorded of what they did have out. They had a lot of cute stuff out. Um, but I show you what I bought. I did go to TJ Maxx. It's in the pile of sh crap. Um, you see a little bit sticking out. That's the carrot. That's from TJ Maxx. Um, but I'll show you what I got at Walmart first. Um, I did show you the Hello Kitty that I got at CVS. The Hello Kitty that was at Walmart. I'm still in the parking lot if you're wondering why I keep pointing. Um, I had to park the whole way up here because I'm in the truck. Walmart's packed. This truck isn't the easiest thing to park. Um, so I'm parked the whole way up here. But plus they have the whole parking lot like blocked off because they're bringing all their summer, spring stuff out. Um, so half the parking lot's gone. Anyway, still in the parking lot doing haul. Um, I forget even what I was saying, but anyway, peephole. So this one was cute. Um, they had some light up peeps. I will show you right here what the light up peep was like. I'll show you here. Those ones were really cute. I didn't get them only because like I figured like once the battery died, like that would suck. Um, and I feel like I have some peeps that look like that. And like once the battery died, like what are you going to do? Cut it open to change the battery? Like I highly doubt I would do that. So I did not get those ones. Um, but I got this one. Look how cute it is with the little tutu on and the little pearl necklace. Adorable. Um, this one was $9.98. Why don't they just say $10? Whatever. Um, so this was $10. So I got that one. And then I got these, which I feel like glitter is like the herpes of crafting materials. I just hate it. But I have like this three tiered like stand type thing in my bathroom that I decorate for every holiday. I have like a tree on it, decorate for every a different holiday. And then like three different um, sections that I just like kind of tear down for decorations and stuff. I hate touching them. But I'm only going to touch them. How many times am I going to touch them? Not sure until I get them on the stand. But just to show you guys, I got a pink one, green, purple, pink, and a yellow. And this bag is just filled with glitter. They're heavy. They're like really heavy. Oh my God, I wish you could just, my husband's going to be like, what did you do? I'm in my husband's track. I'm just like raining glitter. He's going to be like, what did you do? Um, he probably won't even think anything about it. They were $3 a piece. <laughs> just raining glitter. I'm just like, his steering wheel's covered with glitter. He freaking loves it. Okay, $3 a piece. Um, those are going to go in my bathroom, on my tiered stand. Maybe I'll do a decorate with me video. So along with that, on my tree, I got these lights um, because I always normally get these like um, necklace lights. I got two of these, one's in a different bag because I like bag myself. I get to the self checkout. You should have seen these lines were crazy. Bagging myself, didn't even have to wait in line. So I got two of these. I would normally wear one because I go to Zuma class like a couple times a week. And we decorate, we have like a um, Halloween or Halloween party, Easter party, whatever, for every different holiday. We normally dress up. We'll have an Easter party. I'll wear one of those, but normally I keep them on my tree until that party. These are different headbands. I'll put them on my skeletons downstairs. I will do a walkthrough tour for you guys um, on how I decorate for... Easter. These are $4.98. Whoever prices this stuff makes me irritated. $4.98. $5 a piece, which I think is expensive for these, but whatever. Um, one has jelly beans on it, and one has a little tie. Look how sophisticated he is with his tie and glasses on. This one was $3.98 and he has a little hat and bow tie on and this one has a little tie a different tie oh he has a blue tie on and glasses and then this one has the same glasses in a different tie on 
So, um, if you're wondering what skeletons I'm talking about, I have, I think I posted a video on YouTube. I'm not sure. I have like this, um, these two skeletons holding like this, I don't know, container with a whole bunch of different plants and stuff. Like as soon as you walk in my door, um, so I'm going to put those on them. Oh, and then I got these slippers because I wear slippers all the time in my house. And these are in clearance. So I'm like, oh my god, these are so soft. And, um, so yeah, I wear those all the time. Four bucks, whatever. So I have those. That's originally what I went in there for. I think I told you guys to look at the clearance stuff. Went to look at clearance stuff and I didn't buy anything that was on clearance. Bought everything like this. Okay. Ridiculous. Okay, one more bag from Walmart. I'm still laughing at all that glitter here. It's so funny. Okay, then I got, oh, he's cute. I got this one, and then this carrot has like a little glitter carrot thing, and this was $9.98. I can't wait to get all my peeps out. I normally keep them all on one couch. Oh, I gotta show you these. I'm gonna wear these tonight. Okay, then I got these. These are finger puppets, whatever. Put them on my tree. Um, so, like, they're just gonna be my tree decorations. But these were $4.98, five bucks. These are also little lights. Um, you'll see what they look like in my walk through whatever video in Walmart. I'm putting those on my tree as well. Oh, here's my other string lights that I got. Necklace, whatever you want to call it. And that was in that bag. That was all, oh no, not, I'm just, I'm just saying that. I got two more things from Walmart. This was my big peep that I got. Big tie-dye peep. He was so cute. I d wasn't going to get him at first, and I'm like, okay, I'm going to get him. He was $22. He was the last one there. That's why I grabbed him. Little tie-dye guy. So I got him. And then I'm going to Zuma tonight, and I'm like, I feel like I'm going to be from Austin Powers tonight. And I see people, like, make fun of these, but I don't even care. Like, look at these. Like, I feel like straight out of 70s with these on. I don't even care. Love them. Flower child all day long in these. I walked in. I'm like, yes, I'm buying these. I feel like I need them. Okay, so I got this. That is it from Walmart. Then I went to TJ Maxx. And I have like a horse outside my door. And I normally put, like, a wreath on them because my husband's like, oh, they always put, like, wreaths on, like, horses, like, when they win or something. I don't know. So I was like, oh, this this wreath will be cute because I had, like, a wreath on them for Christmas. And I was like, a wreath on them for Easter will be cute. So I got this wreath, Easter wreath for it. It'll be cute. And it's, like, rubber. It's, like, kind of really cute. I had that in my cart and that lady's like, oh, my God, that's so cute. Is there another one? And like, cause I almost didn't get it, and then I got it, cause I had like all them coupons, and I wanted to use them, cause they were like almost expiring. I'm like, and they really didn't have anything to be honest with you. And I was like, oh, I'll just grab that. But that lady kind of wanted it, and I almost kind of gave it to her, but I'm like, I don't go to TJ Maxx a lot. Okay, then she has this wrapped all nice, but opening it like a savage. Then I'm, I picked this up too. Sweetheart. And I just got that for my little tiered stand by my my coffee bar. I think I'm going to put it. And that was it for TJ Maxx. And my random haul today. That was it. So, and then I seen these big costumes. They're like $120. And like if it wasn't so busy in there, like I really wanted to try it on. But then I didn't have anybody to like record me doing it. So like I really want to come back up later tonight and just try these costumes on. 
Uh, I just don't know who would come up with me. I, like, my son would probably come up with me. I wonder if I could talk him into coming up with me. I don't know. But I did record it on TikTok, and I'm like, somebody please, like, needs to try these on because they're freaking amazing. They had a peep one, and then they had, like, this bunny one. I think they had them last year. They, like, have them, like, all the time, I think. At least I've seen them with the masks and stuff. I think they had, like, a... a like a bunny one. I know they had a bunny one. They had a peeps one. And then they had like a chick one, I do believe. Like a peep. Like a little, like a knockoff peep. They were like $120 though. Like, obviously I don't have young kids. Obviously, like, I would just get it just to like be an idiot. And like, who's going to hang out with me if I have that big costume on? Like, I'm sure like people would be like, oh my God, she's like super fun. I would just put it on just to walk around and, like, I wouldn't talk because, like, I wouldn't want anybody to think, I wouldn't I didn't want anybody to know who I was. But then I'd probably be live streaming and, like, everybody would know who I was anyway. So, if anybody, if anybody would like to go with me later on, um, I'm pretty sure that's what I really want to do. So, life goals. Anyway, that is what I'm doing. I'm starving. I don't know whether to... Get something to eat or just go home and get something to eat. What time is it? I don't even know because I have my phone there. Oh, he's flying. She's like flying through here. But lady, this is a parking lot. I don't know whether to get just something to eat or just go home and get something to eat because it's like, I think it's going on like two something. I don't know what time my husband's going to be home. So I should probably go home and just like start cooking something. That's what I do. Let's go home. This truck's so loud. I'm really impressed with this glitter. Like, I just feel like I should go in and just like throw glitter all around and be like, surprise, peep time. So I am frying some mushrooms and onions. Okay, here's my mashed potatoes, and now we're just waiting on the steaks. Oh yeah, they look pretty good. Okay, Jay's the steak master. Fun. Ginger ale lemonade. I actually threw chicken in here for tomorrow. I don't know what I'm gonna do with it yet, but 